So this is a quick video just showing you how PV Cam Test, the new version, works with the Photometrics Prime camera. So it's really nice, we can put live circular buffers on, we can put the exposure time, and we get a nice image up now. Beautiful thing about this is integrators can use this and it's all open source so you can take the bits you want out of it. So it's quite nice, particularly with the Prime, because with the Prime we have Prime Locate. And with Prime Locate we can just say, okay, I want to use um, a number of regions, I'll just press stop, I'm going to say enable, and now I can say, okay, I want to select 300 regions with a radius of 7, so like 15 by 15 areas. And I can just show you Prime Locate working, which is really nice, it cropping those areas out for data reduction. So this is really nice, as I say, as an integrator, you can put that bit in. What's also nice about Prime Locate inside PV Cam Test is we can tell you where the regions are and how big they are and so on per frame that you're capturing. Um, so that's really cool. Another thing that you can do inside PV Cam Test is you can do multiple regions of interest. A lot of the time people will use regions of interest to cut down data or increase speeds and so on. With Prime, we can actually specifically take multiple regions and we can actually say I'm interested in having all of these different regions and I can just cut everything else out from the frame a bit like I was showing you with locate. Or I could specifically do this. I could say, well, look, I want three regions. I'm only bothered looking at three cells and I want to make three movies or I want to take three pictures. And we can do this with up to 16 regions. This is the, the, uh, le, the uh, prime ROI function we have along with the camera. So this is all ready for all of you integrators who want to use Photometrics Prime with your software. I hope this helps. Thanks very much.